Okay, let's do a video, shall we? Now, no one's getting scalped, but the tomahawk is out and in action. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my quick mini review on the Tomahawk 18650. It's a 22-24, I know, that's not voodoo, it does both. Uh, yeah, millimeter mod, and we've got these in brass and copper. So uh, I'm gonna take a little look-see, we're gonna do the whole up close, and I'll just make this one bigger, that one smaller. You know what we did last time. Anyway, it worked really well, you guys enjoyed it. So. Ups and downs, I haven't had any real downs to this. I've enjoyed this one quite a bit. Uh, the Tomahawk 18650 has a really nifty trick in that its button isn't screwed, it's held in place by an O-ring. Okay, so that's really cool. Um, there's no mucking about, there's no faffing. The rest of the gibbons of the button are held in by these allen head screws or grub screws going all the way round and the button is nice and pretty pushy you've got this really cool dome i'll show you in the up close um style button which means it really doesn't matter up or down which way things are going now there's no visible vent holes in this but then the fact that this actually just pops out I can imagine under pressure, the button would just pop out. So, uh, kind of built-in safety feature there, I suppose. Um, battery changing makes life easy. Uh, super dreamy because obviously you just pop the button out and then you drop a new one in. It's awesome, I love it. Um, so yeah, this one is definitely being added to my box of tricks, i.e. ones I'll keep. Um, I'm keeping this one. Now, when I said 22 slash 24, the hybrid section, wipe away the juice, is 22. Insert funky little collar that I was using and you most probably didn't even notice. Hey presto, it's now 24. So yeah, whatever you've got, it's gonna sit flush, which is really, oh, there it goes. <laughs> which is really, really cool in my opinion. There we go. So camera's focusing again, yeah. Color on top, you're back to 24. Match it up with anything you've got, and she's not going to argue. It's kind of like a one size fits all affair, and I like that because I've got a lot of different drippers. I've got them in a lot of different sizes. If you went for something a bit more sharp and pointy, it could look a lot more like a bullet, which may be right up your alley, but hey. Uh, the engraving on it is awesomely, awesomely deep, and yeah. According to all knowledgeable sources, everything's pretty much in place and where it should be. So the button, like I said, pops out. We've got that lovely little dome shape, so it doesn't matter up nor down as to which way it goes. And hey, pressed it. On you go. Um, a cracking little 18650 mod and a fantastic build quality on these ones, mainly because you don't notice that color. You just don't notice that it's on there. And that's awesome because of the rest of the like little ridges that have been put into the mod. It's like ridge, ridge, ridge. And you don't notice that there's a kind of line there. You've got this collar on, which is really, really cool. Um, which gives you a flush fit on everything, which in my opinion is fantastical. Now, I'm not gonna turn all my review videos into a long, fantastical waffle about all the ups and downs and highs and lows. Of course, it's gonna come with the usual and obligatory blue screwdriver, a couple of coils, and a couple of grub screws and bits in the bag. There's gonna be some O-rings in there as per usual. You wouldn't expect anything less now, would you? And of course, a box, which is pretty much a box. It's cheap, you're gonna throw it away, and you're not gonna care about it. Bang for your buck, though, this is fantastic. I'm absolutely loving it because it looks the business. It didn't come with a feather. No, China haven't managed to copy those. But hey, who's complaining really? An awesome, awesome little setup to add to your arsenal, I think, in my opinion. And uh, well, let's say she's good. I love it. Now, of course, if you want it to chuck like that, 
you got to put a decent build in. You got to put a decent battery in. You got to know your business. So make sure you do stay safe when you're vaping mechanical people. And uh, that is it. Like I say, I'm not going to take up all your time and waste your day on a million tiny bits and bobs. It looks the business. You've seen it up close. You've seen my ugly mug waffle about it. I love it. I'm keeping it. I'm using it. Uh, it's one of those. I did get them in. Now, China is doing them in a range of colors. They do black, they do brass, and they do copper. Um, there may even be some splatter to come. Who knows, if it does well enough, they'll splatter it. So yeah, but I'm gonna put that one down there. That one's a keeper for me. That is my 10 cents on the Tomahawk 18650 22 slash 24 millimeter mod. It's an awesome bit of kit. So get on it folks and uh, I'll see you guys around. Now don't forget the Facebook group is like one of the most active places for us. Links down below. If you guys want to join us, join us. It's going to be crazy, crazy fun. And uh, yeah. Get on it. I'll see you around. Until next time, until the next video, have an awesome, awesome time. Vape safe, vape on, vape strong. Was that cheesy or what? Anyhow, I love you all, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm going to click the buy button now. Press that button again. It made a photo. I don't know what it did. Is it still recording me? Let's try that again.